Japanese leaders are moving forward with plans for a shift in national security policy. Prime Minister Shinzo Abe and his cabinet have approved bills that would expand the role of the self-defense forces and allow the country to exercise its right to collective self-defense. The cabinet ministers met on Thursday afternoon. Abe is to hold a news conference shortly to express his resolve to pass the legislation during the current diet session. The legislation would allow the self-defense forces to use force to help countries that have close relationships with Japan. This would apply only when a situation meets the government's three criteria for the use of force. These include when a closely related country comes under an armed attack that threatens Japan's survival and poses a clear danger to the rights of its citizens. The legislation clearly states that there will be no geographical constraints on Japanese logistical support for foreign troops in situations that have an important influence on Japan's peace and security. One of the bills, if enacted, would become a permanent law on logistical support for foreign militaries working for international peace. Up to now, Japan has enacted a special law each time such support was needed. The bill sets a condition that a diet would have to give prior approval without exception to plans to dispatch SDF forces overseas. Members of both houses would have to try to hold a vote within seven days of the prime minister's request for approval. The cabinet will submit the bills to the diet on Friday for deliberation.